Good morning ladies and gentlemen in this video of April we are going to cover the most important current affairs of April if you appreciate our efforts please share this video thank you and let's start the government of india has set up a multidisciplinary terror monitoring group for which of the following states right answer is jammu and kashmir so recently government of india has set up this multidisciplinary terror monitoring group to ensure action against terror financing and terror related activities in jammu and kashmir which of the following defines the event library paris for which india has been designated as chief guest recently right answer is book fair so in order to force the relationship between india and france india has been designated as guest of honor at paris book fair in 2020 while france will be the guest of honor at New Delhi Book Fair in 2022 the announcement was recently made by National Book Trust which IIT has tied up with Wipro for advanced research in 5G and artificial intelligence right answer is IIT Kharagpur so Wipro has recently partnered with IIT Kharagpur to collaborate on areas of 5G and artificial intelligence which international organization has launched the state of global climate report right answer is wmo so wmo that is world meteorological organization has recently launched the state of global climate report which social networking site has recently banned white nationalism and separatism on its platforms right answer is facebook so recently facebook has banned white nationalism and separatism now facebook was also in news as recently it has launched two india specific initiatives in order to boost public participation in 2019 lok sabha elections these two initiatives are candidate connect and share you vote the union government has launched a blockchain enabled marketplace app for which of the following commodities right answer is coffee so recently ministry of commerce has launched a blockchain enabled marketplace app for coffee to help farmers to integrate with markets this will help in getting good price of the commodity if we talk about coffee recently few varieties of coffee has been given gi tag gi stands for geographical indication which indian personality has been honored with croatia's highest civilian award the grand order of king of tomislav right answer is mr ramnath kovin so our president has been recently honored with Croatia's highest civilian award. He is the first ever Indian head of state to visit Croatia. On which date? The 2019 International Day of Solidarity with detained and missing staff members is observed. Right answer is 25th of March. So the International Day of Solidarity with detained and missing staff members is observed every year on 25th of March by United Nations. Who is the author of book Gandhi the writer? right answer is bhavani bhattacharya so the book gandhi the writer was authored by bhavani bhattacharya which airport has been designated as india's best aviation hub by skytrax world airport awards 2019 right answer is indira gandhi international airport so according to skytrax world airport awards igi airport has been designated as india's best airport globally it is on 59th position singapore's changi airport is on the first position who has been conferred with 2019 pravasi bhartiya samman award right answer is mr rajendra joshi so mr rajendra joshi has been conferred with 2019 pravasi bhartiya samman award who has been elected as the first female president of slovakia right answer is ms jujana kaputova so ms jujana kaputova has been elected as the first female president of slovakia which iit has successfully converted petroleum waste toluene into useful product right answer is iit madras so iit madras has successfully converted petroleum waste product toluene into benzoic acid benzoic acid is used as a food preservative and it is also used as a medicine for fungal or bacterial infection hump backed machine sometimes seen in news is found in which of the following 
river basins right answer is kaveri so it was in news as iucn has recently listed humpback mashir as critically endangered in red list of threatened species it is found in the kaveri river basin it is a freshwater fish who has won the men's single title at 2019 miami open tennis tournament right answer is mr roger federer so mr roger federer has won the miami open tennis tournament by defeating mr john isner isro has successfully launched emisat and 28 customer satellites by which launch vehicle right answer is pslv c45 so isro has put emisat into orbit using pslv c45 pslv stands for polar satellite launch vehicle if we talk about emisat it is country's first electronic surveillance satellite for drdo which country's team has won 2019 sultan azlan shah hockey tournament right answer is south korea so south, so south korea has won 2019 sultan azlan shah hockey tournament by defeating india malaysia was the host of this tournament and malaysia defeated canada and secured third place which of the following shipyards has become first indian shipyard to deliver 100 warships right answer is grsc so the garden reach ship builders and engineers limited has become the first indian shipyard to build and deliver 100 warships to indian navy indian coast guard and mauritius coast guard what is the theme of 13th edition of earth hour 2019 right answer is connect to earth so the theme of 13th edition of earth hour was connect to earth earth hour is a worldwide movement organized by worldwide fund for nature 30th of march is also celebrated as rajasthan day which of the following districts has become the world's first district with 5g coverage right answer is hong kong so hong kong district of china has become the first district with 5g coverage if we talk about china the capital of china is beijing and beijing is also the headquarter of shanghai cooperation organization who is the head of tribunal to review ban imposed on jamaat e islami and jklf right answer is mr chandrashekhar so recently home ministry declared jamaat e islami and jklf as unlawful associations under unlawful activities act of 1967 now the government of india has constituted a tribunal to adjudicate whether there are substantial grounds to ban these two organizations the tribunal will be headed by justice chandrashekhar j mahendran who passed away recently was the waiter and filmmaker of which regional cinema right answer is tamil so mr mahendran was a waiter and filmmaker and he passed away in chennai he was the waiter and filmmaker of tamil cinema which iit has tied up with gopichand badminton academy to develop training module right answer is iit khadakpur so recently iit khadakpur has signed a memorandum of understanding with pulela gopichand badminton academy to develop research and training module for the trainees who has won the men's single title at 2019 yonex sunrise india open badminton tournament right answer is mr victor axelson so mr victor axelson of denmark has won the men's single title at 2019 yonex sunrise india open badminton tournament which indian artist has been chosen as glen fidich emerging artist of the year 2019 right answer is mr raju baraiya so mr raju has been selected as the glen fidich emerging artist of the year he is from vadodara gujarat he will represent india at glen fidich artist in the residence program which country has successfully launched second generation data relay tianlian second 01 satellite right answer is china so china has successfully launched the first of its new generation tianlian second 01 data relay satellite into orbit this is first of china's second generation data tracking and relay satellites if we talk about china it is an asian country and the capital of china is beijing what is the theme of 2019 world autism awareness day right answer is assistive technologies active participation so every year on 2nd of april 
World Autism Awareness Day is observed to spread awareness about autism and the theme of this year was Assistive Technologies Active Participation which fictional superhero will be the first entrant into Comic Con Museum's Character Hall of Fame right answer is Batman so Batman will be the first inductee into the Comic Con Museum's Character Hall of Fame who has won the 2019 Formula 1 Bahrain Grand Prix tournament right answer is Lewis Hamilton so Mr Hamilton has won the 2019 Formula 1 Bahrain Grand Prix tournament Mr Hamilton is a British racing driver Kanmal Haldi which recently got GI tag is produced in which of the following states right answer is Odisha so it is a variety of turmeric which is indigenous to southern Odisha and recently it got GI tag India Africa Institute of Agriculture and Research Development will be set up in which of the following countries right answer is Malawi so India has recently signed an agreement with National Bank for Agriculture and Rural Development consultancy service for setting up India Africa Institute of Agriculture and Rural Development in Malawi which country has decided to launch world's first national 5G networks right answer is south korea so recently south korea has announced that it will launch the world's first fully fledged 5G mobile networks on 5th of april mh60r shihok helicopters sometimes seen in news is associated with which of the following countries right answer is usa so recently usa has approved the sale of 24 multi role MH60 Romeo Seahawk helicopters to India. This was approved under its foreign military sales program. The researchers of which country has showed that dark matter is not made up of tiny black holes? Right answer is Japan. So recently, researchers led by Kaveli Institute for Physics and Mathematics of the Universe in Japan have tested the theory speculated by late mr stephen hawking and as per the results the primordial black holes can contribute no more than 0.1% of all dark matter mass therefore it is unlikely the theory is true who is the author of book kundan segal's life and music right answer is sarad dat the book kundan segal's life and music is authored by mr sarad dat the uk researchers have used which telescope to determine the sun's magnetic field is 10 times stronger than thought right answer is 1m solar telescope so as per the new collaborative study by the uk researchers the sun's magnetic field is 10 times stronger than previously thought the study was conducted using swedish 1 meter solar telescope which south american nation has recently joined international solar alliance right answer is bolivia so recently bolivia has joined international solar alliance which indian psychiatrist has won the 2019 john ducks canada gadner global health award right answer is mr vikram patel so professor vikram patel a psychiatrist and professor of global health at harvard medical school has won the prestigious 2019 john ducks canada gardner Global Health Award Cafe Scientific sometimes seen in news is a public science initiative of which state right answer is Kerala in Kerala the group of science experts of Hume Center for Ecology and Wildlife Biology has decided to launch Cafe Scientific to promote science among public in an interesting way so this is first such initiative in the state to popularize the subject Which state has been ranked first in e-learning training program of DOPT of Government of India? Right answer is Telangana. So Telangana has been ranked first in e-learning training program of Department of Personal and Training of Government of India. Which Indian personality has been conferred the UAE's highest civilian honor, Jaid Medal? Right answer is Mr. Modi. So recently. UAE president has conferred 
the prestigious Jayad Medal to Prime Minister Mr. Modi. The President of UAE is Sheikh Khalifa bin Jayad. What is the current repo rate as per RBI's first bi-monthly policy of fiscal year 20? Right answer is 6%. So recently, RBI has announced its first bi-monthly policy of current fiscal year. And the new rates are repo rate is 6%, reverse repo is consequently at 5.7%, marginal standing facility is at 6.2% and bank rate is 6.2%. So RBI has cut its repo rate under liquidity adjustment facility by 20 base points to 6%. What is India's GDP growth forecast for fiscal year 20 according to the Asian Development Outlook of 2019? Right answer is 7.2%. So recently, ADB, that is Asian Development Bank, has released its Asian Development Outlook for 2019. And as per this report, Asian Development Bank has lowered India's growth by 40 basis points to 7.2% in fiscal year 2019 to 2020. Which Southeast Asian country has recently introduced harsh new Sharia laws that make adultery and homosexuality punishable by stoning to death? Right answer is Brunei. So recently Brunei has introduced harsh new Islamic laws to make adultery and homosexuality punishable by stoning to death. Maitri Briz, which is in news recently, is built over which of the following rivers? Right answer is Indus. Maitri Briz is over Indus river and recently Indian Army has constructed this cable suspension bridge. It is longest suspension bridge over a river and it is built by engineers of Sahas or Yogyata Regiment of Indian Army. The bridge is expected to improve the connectivity between Leh and Ladakh. On which date the 2019 International Mine Awareness Day is observed? Right answer is 4th of April. So every year on 4th of April, the International Day for Mine Awareness and Assistance in Mine Action is observed. State of Global Air 2019 report, which was in news recently, is released by which country's health institute? Right answer is USA. So the State of Global Air 2019 report has been released by Boston-based Health Effects Institute. The New Gen Mobility Summit will be held in which of the following countries? Right answer is India. So the New Gen Mobility Summit will be organized by International Center for Automotive Technology at Manisa in Haryana. Fying village which has been tagged as India's first carbon positive settlement is located in which of the following states? Right answer is Manipur. So Fying village is in Manipur and it is considered as India's first carbon positive settlement. Who has become the first Indian to be elected as member of FIFA Executive Council? Right answer is Mr. Praful Patel. So Mr. Praful Patel, the president of All India Football Federation, has become the first Indian to be elected as the member of FIFA Executive Council. The membership in the council will be for four years, from 2019 to 2023. Who has been elected as the new president of World Bank? Right answer is Mr. David Malpass. So Mr. David Malpass has been selected as the new president of World Bank for a period of five years. The World Bank President is Chair of Board of Director of IBRD and IDA. IBRD stands for International Bank for Reconstruction and Development and IDA stands for International Development Association. The festival jashan e Itihad has recently held in which of the following cities? Right answer is New Delhi. So it is a music and poetry festival and it recently held in New Delhi. C. R. Anandwali who passed away recently was the well-known dubbing artist of which regional cinema? Right answer is Malayalam. So Ms. C. R. Anandwali was a well-known dubbing artist in Malayalam film industry. She has passed away recently. Project 75 India sometimes seen in news is associated with which Indian armed force? Right answer is Indian Navy. So the Project 75 India is associated with Indian Navy. So as per the project, Defense Ministry has recently started the process to acquire six advanced submarines. The submarines will be fitted with anti-ship 
cruise missiles and another lethal weapons which indian personality has been conferred an honorary doctorate in philanthropy by the university of law london right answer is mr sharukh khan so mr khan has been conferred with honorary doctorate from university of law london who is the new president of confederation of indian industry right answer is mr vikram kirloskar so recently mr vikram kirloskar has taken charge as the new president of confederation of indian industry exercise western shield which is in news recently will be conducted by which of the following countries right answer is sri lanka so sri lankan army has decided to conduct its largest ever military exercise exercise western shield in july who is the author of book saffron swords centuries of indic resistance to invaders right answer is manoshi sinha rawal so the author of book saffron swords centuries of indic resistance to invaders has been authored by manoshi sinha rawal who cleansed the 2019 men's single malaysia open badminton tournament right answer is lin dan so chinese badminton player mr lin dan cleansed the 2019 men's single malaysia open who has taken oath as the new chief justice of bombay high court right answer is mr pradeep nandarjog so justice pradeep nandarjog has recently taken oath as the new chief justice of bombay high court the oath was administered by maharashtra governor mr vidyasagar rao kushagra rawat is associated to which sports right answer is swimming so mr rawat is associated to swimming and recently he made the b time standard for 2019 fina world championship as well as for the 2020 tokyo olympics india has recently evacuated peacekeeping crpf contingent from which of the following african countries right answer is libya so india has recently evacuated its entire contingent of peacekeeping forces from tripoli in libya libya has been torn by violence and political instability since 2011 when its long term ruler mr gaddafi was deposed what is the theme of 2019 world health day right answer is universal coverage everyone everywhere so every year on 7th of april world health day is observed and the theme of this year was universal health coverage everyone everywhere global cooling coalition which was in news has been launched in which of the following countries right answer is denmark so the first ever global coalition on clean and efficient cooling was launched at the first global conference in copenhagen in denmark which of the following indian companies has won the global slag company of the year award right answer is tata steel so tata steel has been named as global slag company of the year who has been named as female sports person of the year at espn india multi sport awards 2018 right answer is pv sindhu so miss pv sindhu and mr neeraj chopra has been named as female and male sports person of the year in the espn india multi sport awards which indian armed force has tied up with csir for joint research right answer is indian navy so indian navy has signed a memorandum of understanding with csir for joint research who has been appointed as amicus curiae by the kerala high court on kerala floods right answer is mr jacob p alex so recently kerala high court has appointed mr jacob p alex as amicus curiae exercise african line 2019 has conducted between which of the following countries right answer is morocco and us so the african line 2019 is a joint military exercise between morocco and us who has been appointed as new chief coach of india men's hockey team right answer is mr graham reed so mr graham reed from australia has been appointed as new chief coach of indian men's hockey team till end of 2020 nobel laureate sydney brenner who passed away recently was from which country right answer is south africa sydney brenner a south african born biologist has passed away recently 
Isaac Hayek who has become the world's oldest soccer player is from which country right answer is Israel Mr Isaac Hayek is from Israel and he has set a new world record as the oldest person to play in a professional soccer match at the age of 73 which international organization has released its latest report on south asia economic focus exports wanted right answer is world bank so recently world bank has released a report south asia economic focus exports wanted as per this report india gdp growth is expected to accelerate moderately to 7.5% in present fiscal year which country is the highest recipient of remittances in 2018 as per world bank's latest report migration and development brief right answer is our country so india has retained its position as world's top recipient of remittances as per the latest report by world bank the name of report is migration and development brief india was followed by china mexico philippines and egypt on which date the international day of reflection on 1994 rwanda genocide is observed recently right answer is april 7 so the international day of reflection on 1994 rwanda genocide is observed every year on 7th of april in the memory of victims of genocide in rwanda the scientists at which us university have found that cold plasma can kill 99.9% of airborne viruses right answer is university of michigan so recently scientists from university of michigan in united states have found that dangerous airborne viruses can be rendered harmless when exposed to cold plasma next is rbi has recently tweaked lcr norms to boost liquidity what does lcr stands for right answer is liquidity coverage ratio so recently rbi has tweaked liquidity coverage ratio to improve cash position of banks which institute has been ranked as the best educational institution in 2019 national institutional ranking framework right answer is iit madras so iit madras has been ranked on top in the overall category in the latest edition of NIRF IIT Madras is followed by Indian Institute of Science IIT Delhi IIT Bombay IIT Kharagpur and various other IITs Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps which is in news recently is associated to which of the following countries right answer is Iran so recently USA has designated Iran's elite military force Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps as a foreign terrorist organization who has won the 2019 women's singles monterey open tennis tournament right answer is garbin muguruza so recently spain's garbin muguruza has successfully defended her monterey open title who is the current chairperson of ngt that is national green tribunal right answer is mr adars kumar goel So Mr Adars Kumar Goel is the current chairperson of NGT. NGT was in news recently as NGT has constituted a committee to look into the alleged erosion of Yamuna flood plains due to movement of heavy vehicles in Haryana's Sonipat district. Which of the following cities has become the world's first city to implement 24 by 7 pollution charge zone? Right answer is London. So London has become world's first city to implement a special ultra low emission zone that would charge an entry fees for older vehicles if they do not meet the emission standards that means pollution emission standards exercise bold kurukshetra 2019 held between india and which of the following countries right answer is singapore so the joint military exercise bold kurukshetra held between indian navy and singapore armed forces this exercise held in jhansi in uttar pradesh 2019 mena world economic forum was held in which of the following countries right answer is jordan so the world economic forum in the middle east and north africa 2019 was held at dead sea in jordan the bombay stock exchange has recently tied up 
with which bank to give boost to startup platform right answer is hdfc bank so recently bombay stock exchange has signed a memorandum of understanding with hdfc bank to give a boost to startups platform the move will offer banking and lending solutions to eligible startups which are already listed or due to be listed on bsc startup platform under which article of constitution the election commission of india has prohibited display of any biopic or publicity material during moral code of conduct period right answer is article 324 so as per article 324 of indian constitution election commission of india has recently issued an order prohibiting display of any content that subserves the purpose of any political party or any individual connected to this matter which iit has tied up with general electric to set up india's first cold spray smart lab right answer is iit madras so iit madras has tied up with general electric to set up india's first cold spray smart laboratory this laboratory will develop advanced services technology for aircraft engine components which indian education technology startup has won the $25000 next billion edtech prize 2019 right answer is dost education so india's education technology startup dost education has bagged a $25000 next billion edtech prize 2019 t90 tanks sometimes seen in news is associated to which of the following countries right answer is russia so t90 tanks are associated to russia recently in order to boost capabilities the government of india has cleared the procurement of t90 tanks from russia which india's flagship program has won the 2019 world water agency of year at global water summit right answer is namami gange so the government's initiative namami mission for clean ganga was awarded public water agency of the year by global water intelligence at global water summit in london the supreme court has imposed a fine of rupee 20 lakh on which state government for banning a satirical film bhobishottar bhoot right answer is west bengal so recently supreme court has imposed a fine of rupee 20 lakh on the west bengal government for imposing a virtual ban on the public screening of satirical film bhobishottar bhoot in the state who has been selected for 2018 saraswati samman right answer is k shiva reddy so telugu poet mr k shiva reddy has been selected for the prestigious saraswati samman 2018 which indian cricketer has been named as wisdom's leading cricketer in the world for 2018 right answer is virat kohli so mr kohli has been named as the leading cricketer of the year for an unprecedented third year in a row which country has recently sent a team of experts to remeasure the height of mount everest right answer is nepal so the nepal government has recently sent a four member team of experts to remeasure the height of mount everest the scientists at which university have developed a new pin sized sensor that can detect dangerous chemicals right answer is university of wisconsin medicine so recently the scientist of university of Wisconsin Medicine in US have developed a sensor that can detect dangerous chemicals the sensor is a pin sized sensor next is who has been appointed as new chief justice of Andhra Pradesh high court right answer is mr vikram nath so justice vikram nath has been appointed as the new chief justice of Andhra Pradesh high court what is the theme of 2019 national safe motherhood day right answer is midwives for mothers So the National Safe Motherhood Day is observed every year on 11th of April to raise awareness about women health care. The theme of this year was Midwives for Mothers. India is first country in the world to have officially declared a National Safe Motherhood Day. As per which section of RTI Act the government of India cannot refuse information if disclosure in public interest overshadows certain protected interest right answer is section 8 subsection 2 in a recent verdict supreme court
has clearly said this that right to information act supersedes the official secret act as per the section 8 subsection 2 of right to information act the information cannot be denied if disclosure in public interest overshadows certain protected interests which indian personality has been chosen for russia's highest civilian award order of saint andrew the apostle right answer is mr modi so russian government has announced to confer the order of saint andrew the apostle the highest state decoration of country on prime minister mr modi the jallianwala bag massacre was held in which of the following years right answer is 1919 so the jallianwala bag massacre held in 1919 and this year this horrific incident completed 100 years the massacre is one of the darkest chapter of india's freedom struggle against british occupation and on 13th of april 2019 the nation paid homage to the martyrs of jallianwala bag massacre on the centenary of the incident which international agency has recently published a state of world population 2019 report right answer is unfpa so recently united nations population fund has recently released a state of world population 2019 report which mobile wallet provider has tied up with mmtc pmp india to launch gold buying future right answer is google pay so recently google has tied up with mmtc pamp india to introduce buying and selling of gold through app that means now user can buy gold through google pay app the scientists at which university have discovered chain melted state of matter right answer is university of edinburgh so scientists at university of edinburgh have discovered a new state of physical matter which allows atoms to exist as both solid and liquid at the same time until now atoms in physical matter were understood to exist in one of the three states that means either liquid or solid or gas next is who has become the first ever captain to win 100 matches in ipl history right answer is mr ms dhoni so mr dhoni has become the first ever captain in ipl history to win 100 matches if we talk about cricket recently mr virat kohli has been named as the leading cricketer by the 2019 edition of wisdom cricketers humo lucenesis which is in news recently has discovered in which of the following countries right answer is philippines so recently scientists have discovered new species of ancient human excavations in philippines this newly identified species has been named humo lucenesis after luzon island where the bones and teeth from individuals were excavated which of the following countries will be the guest of honor country at abu dhabi international book fair right answer is india so india will be the guest of honor country at the 2019th abu dhabi international book fair who has been appointed as new secretary of defense finance right answer is miss gargi kol so miss gargi kol has been appointed as new secretary of defense finance which indian city has been ranked first on the who's list of 15 most polluted cities right answer is kanpur so recently a delhi based environment body climate trends has released a report the name of report is political leaders position and action on air quality in india sabuj sathi project of which indian state has got the un backed wsis prize 2019 right answer is west bengal so utkrish bangla and sabuj sathi schemes of west bengal has won the world summit on information society awards of united nations which indian personality has been honored with the freedom of city of london right answer is alice g vedden so miss vedden the cmd of general insurance corporation of india has been awarded the freedom of city of london for her efforts to promote ties between india and uk which of the following telescopes has captured the first ever black hole image right answer is eht that means event horizon telescope so recently astronomers have captured 
the first ever image of black hole which is located in a galaxy known as Messier 87 and the image was captured through linked telescopes known as Event Horizon Telescope which Indian spokesperson is the recipient of New Zealand Prime Minister's Sir Edmund Hillary Fellowship for 2019? Right answer is Miss Deepa Malik. So Miss Malik has been named the recipient of New Zealand Prime Minister's Sir Edmund Hillary Fellowship for 2019 in the recognition of her inspiring achievements. Who has been appointed as first ever Women Vice Chancellor of Jamia Millia Islamia University? Right answer is Miss Najma Akhtar. So Miss Akhtar has become the first ever Women Vice Chancellor of Jamia Millia Islamia University. She is also the first lady Vice Chancellor of any central university in Delhi. Which tech giant has launched a new open platform Anthos to run and manage apps from anywhere? Right answer is Google. So recently Google has introduced a new open platform called Anthos to run and manage apps from anywhere. It is based on cloud services platform. Which of the following banks has signed the first co-origination loan agreement with Paisalo Digital? Right answer is SBI that means State Bank of India. To empower agri MSME segment and small businesses, SBI has signed the first co-origination loan agreement with Paisalo Digital Limited. Now this will enable the customers to use the platform for smooth loan processing and repayment. Who has been appointed as the new CMD of National Building Construction Corporation? Right answer is Mr. Siv Dasmina. So Mr. Siv Dasmina has been appointed as the CMD of National Buildings Construction Corporation. India and which European country have launched joint industrial research and development program to address shared challenges? Right answer is Sweden. So India and Sweden have recently launched India-Sweden Collaborative Industrial Research and Development Program. Meena Kumari has cleansed gold in which category at Cologne Boxing World Cup 2019? Right answer is 54 kg. So Miss Meena Kumari from Manipur has cleansed the gold in 54 kg category at 2019 Boxing World Cup in Cologne in Germany. Which country is to host the world's foremost artificial intelligence summit? Right answer is UAE. So world's foremost artificial intelligence summit will be held in Dubai in UAE. Geleta Burka who won the women's race at the Paris Marathon 2019 is from which country? Right answer is Ethiopia. So Ethiopian athletes Geleta Burka has won women's race at Paris Marathon while Abra Mila has won the men's race at Paris Marathon. The people of which state has recently celebrated Vishu as their new year? Right answer is Kerala. So recently people of Kerala celebrated Malayalam new year Vishu. Who has become the first Indian to be appointed chair of International Hockey Federation Health and Safety Committee? Right answer is Vibhu. Kalyan Nayak. So Mr. Nayak from Bhuneshwar has become the first Indian to be appointed as Chair of International Hockey Federation Health and Safety Committee. Who has been conferred with Lifetime Achievement Award 2019 at 4th APJ Abdul Kalam Innovation Conclave? Right answer is Mr. A.K. Singh. So Director General at Life Sciences DRDO. Dr. A.K. Singh has been conferred with Lifetime Achievement Award recently. He is the Director General at Life Sciences DRDO. Who of the following has been chosen for 2019 UNESCO Guillermo Cano Press Freedom Prize? Right answer is Kiao So U. So journalist Kiao So U and Wallon has been chosen for 2019 UNESCO Guillermo Cano Press Freedom Prize. Both these are serving prison sentence in Myanmar. They were arrested for reporting on alleged human rights violations in Myanmar's Rakhine state. Which of the following banks has topped Forbes list of Indian banks 2019? Right answer is HDFC Bank. So recently Forbes has 
compiled a first ever list of world's best banks in terms of customer services and in terms of technological advancements so as per this list hdfc bank is on top in india who has been sworn in as the new prime minister of palestine right answer is mr mohammad sateh so dr mohammad sateh has been sworn in as the new prime minister of state of palestine by president mr mahmud abbas the central marine fisheries research institute has tied up with which scientific institute to protect coastal wetlands right answer is isro so central marine fisheries research institute and isro have tied up to protect coastal wetlands on which date the 2019 international day of human space flight is observed right answer is 12th of april so 12th of april is observed as international day of human space flight 12th of april is special because on 12th of april in 1961 the first human space flight was carried out by yuri gagarin a soviet citizen india's first of its kind water park has recently inaugurated in which of the following cities right answer is gurugram so india's first water park has been inaugurated in gurugram in haryana the objective of this initiative is to spread awareness and to educate people about electoral process what is the theme of 2019 world allergy week right answer is the global problem of food allergy so world allergy week is an annual initiative of world allergy organization the objective is to spread awareness of allergic diseases and related disorders this year the allergy week was from 7th of april to 13th of april and the theme was the global problem of food allergy next is pradeep chobe who passed away recently was the renowned personality in which field right answer is poetry so mr chobe was a renowned hindi poet he passed away recently which country has developed the world's first armed amphibious drone boat right answer is china so china has successfully developed the world's first armed amphibious drone boat which indian sports person has clinched the 2019 dutch international badminton title right answer is mr harshil dani so mr harshil dani has clinched the 2019 dutch international badminton title the fourth resilient cities asia pacific congress has started in which of the following cities right answer is new delhi so the fourth resilient cities asia pacific congress started in new delhi the event is being organized in india for the first time and therefore it is important from exam perspective the event was inaugurated by vice president mr m venkaiya naidu india's first foreign interactive and exotic bird park has come up in which of the following cities right answer is mumbai so in mumbai sl world launched india's first foreign interactive and exotic bird park this is first bird park in india to host three different varieties of birds that means aquatic birds terrestrial birds and free flying birds the women's safety app my circle has been launched by which of the following telecom companies right answer is bharti airtel so bharti airtel in collaboration with fikki ladies organization has launched women's safety app my circle which is the operational range of india's first indigenously designed subsonic cruise missile nirbhay right answer is 1000 km so drdo has recently successfully test fired nirbhay missile the operational range of missile is 1000 km and it has terrain hugging capability that means it can fly very low to the ground so that it can avoid detection by the enemy radar and that's why it is said to have terrain hugging capability it is india's first indigenously designed and developed long range subsonic cruise missile notre dame sometimes seen in news is located in which country right answer is france so notre dame is a cathedral and it is located in france in paris recently it was in news because of the fire incident in the cathedral 
The historic Muzib Nagar Day has recently celebrated in which of the following countries? Right answer is Bangladesh. So on 17th of April, Bangladesh celebrated historic Muzib Nagar Day. It is special for Bangladesh because this day marks the oath-taking ceremony of Bangladesh first government in 1971, which IIT has found a new method to detect breast and ovarian cancer. Right answer is IIT Roorkee. So IIT Roorkee have identified new methods to detect breast and ovarian cancer. ICC has partnered with which UN organization to organize hashtag One Day for Children at the Men's Cricket World Cup 2019? Right answer is UNICEF. So ICC has partnered with UNICEF to organize hashtag One Day for Children at the Men's Cricket World Cup event. And the money raised through this initiative will support UNICEF's work in cricket playing nations to help children learn to play and be healthy. The 8th edition of Home Expo India 2019 has started in which of the following cities? Right answer is Greater Noida. So the 8th edition of Home Expo India 2019 started in Greater Noida. The exhibition has been organized by Export Promotion Council for Handicrafts. Next is Indo-Pacific Wing which is in news recently has been set up by which of the following union ministries? Right answer is Ministry of External Affairs. So MEA has set up an Indo-Pacific division in foreign office to integrate Indian Ocean Rim Association, ASEAN region and the Quad. The Human Exploration Rover Challenge 2019 has recently conducted by which of the following space agencies? Right answer is NASA. So it was conducted by NASA and recently in 25th edition of Human Exploration Rover Challenge, three Indian student teams won awards. What is the theme of 2019 World Hemophilia Day? Right answer is Outreach and Identification. World Hemophilia Day is celebrated on 17th of April each year to spread awareness and the theme of this year was Outreach and Identification. It will be observed with a slogan Reaching Out the First Step to Care. Which Indian institution has launched a 5G lab for banking and financial sector? Right answer is RBI. So recently IDRBT that means Institute for Development and Research in Banking Technology which is a arm of RBI has launched a 5G use cases lab for banking and financial sector. So this use of 5G will change a range of technologies and applications in the banking sector which are now using 2G. Dr. S. K. Siv Kumar who passed away recently was a renowned scientist in which field? Right answer is space. So he was associated with ISRO and he was renowned space scientist. He passed away recently. Which country has launched its first satellite Raman 1 into space? Right answer is Sri Lanka. So Sri Lanka has launched its first satellite Raman 1 into space. Under BIRDS project, the satellite was designed and developed at Kaishu Institute of Technology in Japan. Nepal has successfully launched its first satellite Nepali Sat first into space under BIRDS project of which country? Right answer is Japan. So Nepal has launched its first satellite. So both Nepal and Sri Lanka have launched their first satellite under BIRDS project. This project is an initiative of Kaishin Institute of Technology of Japan. The BIRDS project has been designed in association with the United Nations and the objective of this project is to help countries to launch their first satellite. Rare Kakapo parrots sometimes seen in news are found in which of the following countries? Right answer is New Zealand. So critically endangered Kakapos, the world's fattest species of parrot, were recently found in New Zealand. Liquid methane has recently spotted on which satellite in solar system? Right answer is Titan. So using data obtained by NASA's Cassini spacecraft, the researchers discovered deep lakes filled with methane on Saturn's moon Titan. Who has been named as Goodwill Ambassador of 
Indian team for Street Child Cricket World Cup? Right answer is Miss Mitali Raj. So Miss Mitali Raj has been named as Goodwill Ambassador of Indian team for Street Child Cricket World Cup. The researchers of which country have successfully printed the world's first 3D heart by using patient's biological material? Right answer is Israel. So researchers of Israel have successfully printed the world's first 3D heart by using patient's biological material. If we talk about Israel, recently elections held in Israel and Mr. Benjamin Netanyahu got re-elected again. TESS, mission of which space agency, has discovered its first Earth-sized planet HD 21749C? Right answer is NASA. So recently, TESS, mission of NASA, has discovered its first Earth-sized planet HD 21749C. Now TESS stands for Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite. What is the theme of 2019 World Heritage Day? Right answer is Rural Landscapes. If we talk about important days of April month, 17th of April is World Hemophilia Day and the theme was Outreach and Identification. Learning Coin which is in news recently is launched by which of the following international organizations? Right answer is IMF. So recently IMF and World Bank have jointly launched a project called Learning Coin. It is a private blockchain based coin and only accessible within the IMF and World Bank to help multinational agencies to learn about the merits of blockchain. Who has been honored with 2019 Pulitzer Prize in Fiction category? Right answer is Richard Powers. So Mr. Richard Powers has been honored with 2019 Pulitzer Prize in fiction category for his novel The Over Story. Choifel Kudling Monastery, which is in news recently, is located in which of the following countries? Right answer is Nepal. So this Choifel Kudling Monastery has been recently inaugurated in Nepal. The monastery has been reconstructed with Government of India grant. Mueller report, sometimes seen in news, is associated to which of the following causes? Right answer is Russian interference in 2016 US presidential election. So recently this report was in news and Russia has recently dismissed the findings of this Mueller report. Russia has denied the allegations of meddling into election and said that there are no substantial evidences of Russian interference in 2016 US elections. The report is named Mueller Report on the name of Mr. Robert Mueller, who has been appointed as new Prime Minister of Israel. Right answer is Mr. Benjamin Netanyahu. So recently elections held in Israel and Mr. Benjamin Netanyahu is expected to form government again. Recently, Israeli President has formally nominated Mr. Netanyahu to form government. ISO 31000-2018 is a standard related to which of the following tasks? Right answer is risk management. It is related to risk management. Recently, Cholamandalam MS General Insurance Company Limited has been certified with this certification for its risk management system in line with the standard. So it means this standard is associated with risk management. Which of the following banks? has partnered with M1 Exchange TREDS platform for MSME bill discounting. Right answer is Bank of Maharashtra. So recently, Bank of Maharashtra has partnered with M1 Exchange TREDS platform for MSME bill discounting. If we talk about TREDS, it is Trade Receivables Discounting System. It is a digital platform to support MSME to get their bills Financed at a competitive rate through an auction. MSME stands for Micro, Small and Medium Enterprises. Which Indian cricketer has been appointed brand ambassador of bus ticketing platform Red Bus? Right answer is Mr. Dhoni. So Mr. MS Dhoni has been appointed as the brand ambassador of bus ticketing platform Red Bus. Jerry Cobb, who passed away recently, was the first female astronaut candidate of which space agency? Right answer is NASA. So Miss Jerry Cobb 
was the first female astronaut of NASA and she recently passed away. If we talk about NASA, NASA is a space agency of USA. NASA stands for National Aeronautics and Space Administration. Christina Koch, who will set a new record for longest space flight by a woman, is the astronaut of which space agency? Right answer is NASA. So Miss Christina Koch is associated with NASA and she will set record for longest single space flight by a woman. Her mission on International Space Station has extended to 328 days. On which date the 2019 National Civil Services Day is observed in India? Right answer is 21st April. So National Civil Services Day is organized every year on 21st of April. This day is special because on this day first home minister of independent India that means Sardar Vallabh Bhai Patel addressed the probationers of administrative services officers and he referred to civil servants as the steel frame of India. Which of the following banks has launched paperless account opening facility for NRIs that means for non-resident Indians? Right answer is IDBI Bank. So recently IDBI Bank has launched NRI Insta online account opening process for NRI residing in FATF member countries. A site containing 220 million year old fossilized remains of dinosaurs has recently discovered in which country? Right answer is Argentina. So recently a site containing that 220 million years old fossilized remains of dinosaurs has been discovered in western Argentina. Who has been appointed as India's new High Commissioner to South Africa? Right answer is Mr. Jadeep Sarkar. So Mr. Jadeep Sarkar has been appointed as India's next High Commissioner to South Africa. Apart from him, recently Suhail Ajaj Khan has been appointed as India's next Ambassador to Lebanon. Who was the author of Jallianwala Bagh poem Khuni Baisakhi? Right answer is Mr. Nanak Singh. So recently, a book containing the English translation of Punjabi poem about Jallianwala Bagh massacre, Khuni Baisakhi, has been released in Abu Dhabi. This year, 13th April, marked the 100 years of Jallianwala Bagh massacre incident. Which of the following banks has become the first public sector bank in India to meet RBI's EMV mandate? Right answer is Canara Bank. So recently, Canara Bank has become the first public sector bank in India to meet RBI's new EMV mandate. If we talk about EMV, it is Europe, MasterCard and Visa. So this EMV shift is aimed at reducing lost and stolen card fraud and it will make it difficult to counterfeit card fraud. On which date the 2019 World Lever Day is observed? Right answer is April 19th. So every year on 19th of April, the World Lever Day is observed to spread awareness about our lever. Which country will host the G20 summit in 2020? Right answer is Saudi Arabia. So Saudi Arabia will host the 15th edition of G20 summit in Riyadh. So this would be the first G20 summit to be hosted by an Arab country. In 2018, the G20 summit held in Argentina while in 2019 it will be in Japan. What is the India's rank in 2019 World Press Freedom Index? Right answer is 140th. So recently World Press Freedom Index was released. As per this, India has slipped two places to rank 140. It has been released by Reporters Without Borders. Exercise Varun 2019 will be conducted between India and which country? Right answer is France. So it is a joint exercise between India and France. It is a novel exercise. Which of the following Indian Navy ships are participating in International Fleet Review? Right answer is INS Kolkata. So two of Indian Navy warships INS Kolkata and INS Sakti will participate in International Fleet Review in Qingdao in China. Who has become the India's first female scientist to be elected Royal Society Fellow? 
right answer is miss gagandeep kang so miss gagandeep kang has become the india's first female scientist to be elected royal society fellow which football team has won 2019 santosh trophy right answer is services so in football services lifted the 2019 santosh trophy by defeating punjab which indian armed force has launched guided missile destroyer imphal right answer is indian navy so indian navy has launched guided missile destroyer ins imphal it is third warship built as a part of project 15b under project 15b the navy had launched first ship ins visakhapatnam in 2015 while the second ship was marmagao and ins imphal is third ship who won the 2019 presidential election of ukraine right answer is volodymyr zelensky so mr zelensky who was a comedian earlier has recently won the election in ukraine mr zelensky is best known for his role in tv series servants of the people the novel commanders conference 2019 will be held in which of the following cities right answer is new delhi so the first edition of novel commanders conference 2019 held in new delhi the conference act as a platform for institutionalized interaction of novel commanders with senior government officials amar paul who passed away recently was the legendary folk singer of which language right answer is bengali so mr amar paul was the legendary bengali folk singer he passed away recently which country has recently adopted the national artificial intelligence strategy 2031 right answer is uae so recently uae has adopted a new national artificial intelligence strategy 2031 the objective of this policy is to position uae as global leader in artificial intelligence by 2031 which indian movie has won the best cinematography at 2019 beijing international film festival right answer is bhayankam that means fear so recently malayalam film bhayankam directed by mr jairaz has won the best cinematography award at 2019 beijing international film festival who has been appointed as new chairman of export promotion council for handicraft right answer is mr ravinder kumar pasi so mr ravinder kumar pasi has been appointed as the chairman of export promotion council for handicrafts if we talk about epcs it was established under companies act and it is a non profit organization the objective of this organization is to promote the export of handicrafts which un agency has listed the 1984 bhopal gas tragedy among world's major industrial accidents of 20th century right answer is ilo so recently ilo that is international labor organization has released a report the safety and health at the heart of future of work building on 100 years of experience what is the theme of 2019 world earth day right answer is protect our species so every year on 22nd of april world earth day is observed and the theme of this year world earth day was protect our species which scheme of west bengal government has won the 2019 world summit on information society award in capacity building category right answer is utkrish bangla so recently utkrish bangla scheme of west bengal government has won the world summit on information society award of united nations in capacity building category which country has been nominated as guest of honor country at 2019th edition of abu dhabi international book fair right answer is india so india has been nominated as guest of honor country at 2019th edition of abu dhabi international book fair which indian sports person has clinched india's first gold at 2019 asian wrestling championship right answer is mr bajrang punia so mr bajrang punia has clinched india's first gold at asian wrestling championship held in china on which date 
the un english language day is observed right answer is april 23rd so every year on 23rd of april un english language day is observed the idea is to promote multilingualism as well as to promote equal use of all six languages which indian sports person has clinched india's first gold in 2019 asian athletics championship in doha right answer is miss gomti marimuthu so miss gomti from tamil nadu has clinched india's first gold in women's 800 meter race at 2019 asian athletics championship in doha in qatar which space agency has revealed that mercury has a massive solid inner core right answer is nasa so recently nasa has revealed that mercury has a massive solid inner core this is based on observations from nasa's messenger mission messenger stands for mercury surface space environment geochemistry and ranging so based on nasa's messenger mission nasa has revealed that mercury has a massive solid inner core which african country has launched the pilot test for world's first malaria vaccine rts s right answer is malawi so the government of malawi has launched the pilot test for world's first malaria vaccine rts s to give a partial protection to children up to 2 years of age who has been conferred with national intellectual property award for 2019 in the category of top individual for patents and commercialization right answer is benny antoni so dr benny antoni has been conferred with national intellectual property award for 2019 in the category of top individual for patents and commercialization on which date the 2019 national panchayati raj day is celebrated in india right answer is 24th of april so national panchayati raj day is celebrated every year on 24th of april by ministry of panchayati raj it is also known as national local self government day this day is special because on this day in 1993 the 73rd constitutional amendment act came into force that institutionalized panchayati raj what is india's rank in 2019 index of cancer preparedness right answer is 19th so recently economist intelligence unit has released a index of cancer preparedness as per this india's ranking is 19th out of total 28 countries the index has been topped by australia if we talk about cancer on 4th of february world cancer day is celebrated to spread the awareness hope probe project sometimes seen in news is associated to which of the following countries right answer is uae so hope probe project is a project of uae to send mission to mars it will be launched in july 2020 and uae will be the first arab country to make mars mission a reality which of the following it services companies has signed a deal with india post to transform country's mail delivery system right answer is tcs so recently india's largest it services company tcs has partnered with department of post to modernize a network of more than 1.5 lakh post offices across the country iran and which country have decided to set up a joint border reaction force right answer is pakistan so recently iran and pakistan have decided to set up a joint border reaction force which union ministry has signed memorandum of understanding with csir for cooperation in research and education right answer is ministry of ayush so recently ministry of ayush has signed a memorandum of understanding with csir for cooperation in research and education in the areas of traditional systems of medicine and its proper integration with modern sciences which airborne observatory has detected the universe first molecule in space right answer is sofia so sofia that is stratospheric observatory for 
infrared astronomy airborne observatory has detected the universe first molecule in space that is helium hydride ion so helium hydride ion was the first molecule that was formed in universe the world's tallest 131 feet indoor waterfall has opened in which of the following countries right answer is singapore so recently world's tallest 131 feet indoor waterfall has opened for general public at singapore's changi airport on which date the 2019 world book and copyright day is observed recently right answer is 23rd of april so 23rd of april is observed as world book and copyright day which of the following cities has been declared as 2019 world book capital right answer is sarja so for 2019 sarja in uae has been declared as world book capital next year that is in 2020 kuala lumpur in malaysia will be the world book capital the london school of economics and political science has established a new academic position in honor of which indian born philosopher and economist right answer is mr amartya sen so london school of economics and political science has established amartya sen chair in inequality studies to honor the indian born economist philosopher and nobel laureate in 1998 mr sen won the nobel prize in economics the asian tea alliance has recently launched in which of the following cities right answer is guizhou so recently asian tea alliance has been launched in guizhou in china the tea association of five countries are the members of this alliance these five countries are india china indonesia sri lanka and japan so this tea alliance has been launched in china the fifth asia pacific broadcasting union media summit on climate action and disaster preparedness has started in which of the following cities right answer is kathmandu so kathmandu is the host of fifth asia pacific broadcasting union media summit on climate action and disaster preparedness and the theme of this summit was media solutions for sustainable future saving lives building resilient communities what is the theme of 2019 world intellectual property day right answer is reach for gold ip and sports so every year on 26th of april world intellectual property day is observed and the theme of this year is reach for gold ip and sports divyan singh pawar who secured 2020 tokyo olympics quota is associated to with sports right answer is shooting so mr pawar is associated to shooting and recently he won silver medal in 10 meter air rifle event in addition to that he also secured a quota for 2020 tokyo olympics next is which of the following banks has launched india's first green car loan at lower interest rates right answer is sbi so recently sbi has launched india's first green car loan to encourage customers to buy electric vehicles so as a incentive sbi is providing loans on lesser interest rate and sbi is also giving longer repayment period the scientists of which country have successfully created the first ever artificial crater on asteroid raigu right answer is japan so recently japanese scientists have successfully created the first ever artificial crater on asteroid raigu it was done through hayabusa 2 as recently hayabusa 2 probe fired an explosive device at raigu asteroid to blast a crater what is the theme of 2019 world immunization week right answer is protected together vaccines work so 2019 world immunization week is a global public health campaign by who from 24th of april to 30th of april and the theme was protected together vaccines work Indonesia has recently released a special Ramayana themed stamp to mark 70 years of diplomatic ties with India. It was designed by which of the following sculptures? Right answer is 
Bapak Nyoman Nuarta. So recently, Indonesia has released a special stamp on the theme of Ramayana to mark the 70th anniversary of establishment of diplomatic ties with India. Bapi Colombo, sometimes seen in news, is associated to which of the following space agencies? Right answer is JAXA, that is Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency. So Bapi Colombo is a joint mission of European Space Agency and JAXA to the planet Mercury. Which former army chief has been appointed as India's new High Commissioner to Seychelles? Right answer is Mr. Dalbi Singh. So Mr. Singh has been appointed as India's new High Commissioner to Republic of Seychelles. Where is the headquarter of Centre for Cellular and Molecular Biology? Right answer is Hyderabad. So the headquarter of CCMB is in Hyderabad in Telangana. Recently, Department of Biotechnology has decided to fund CCMB and National Research Centre for Meat for research on cell-based meat. Cell-based meat is also known as clean meat or cultured meat. Which of the following heritage sites is the motif of greenish yellow rupee 20 denomination banknotes? Right answer is Allora Caves. So recently RBI announced that it will shortly issue rupee 20 denominations banknotes. The new denomination has motif of Allora Caves on the reverse side that depicts the country's cultural heritage. Which Indian Defence Organisation has signed a pact with NHPC for construction of tunnels on China and Pakistan borders? Right answer is Indian Army. So recently, Indian Army signed a Memorandum of Understanding with National Hydroelectric Power Corporation to construct underground tunnels for storage of ammunition along Pakistan and China border. Who is the head of CPWD committee to formulate design policy for building construction? Right answer is MK Sarma. So recently CPWD that is Central Works Public Department has constituted an expert committee to formulate a design policy for building construction and infrastructure development. And the head of this committee is MK Sarma. Rama Sen Gupta Pol who passed away recently was the veteran personality in which field? Right answer is mountaineering. So Miss Rama Sen Gupta Pol, the veteran lady mountaineer, has passed away recently in West Bengal. Puranik Yogendra, who has become the first ethnic Indian to contest and win an election in Japan, is from which of the following Indian cities? Right answer is Pune. So Mr. Puranik Yogendra is from Pune and he has become the first ethnic Indian to contest and win an election in Japan. Who is the head of IRDAI committee to review micro insurance framework? Right answer is Mr. Suresh Mathur. So recently IRDAI that is Insurance Regulatory Development Authority of India has constituted a committee to review micro insurance framework. And Mr. Suresh Mathur is the head of this committee. Which country has recently pledged 4 million to support Modern Slavery Innovation Fund? Right answer is Britain. So recently, Britain has pledged 4 million to support global anti-slavery projects. The Modern Slavery Innovation Fund supports international projects to trial innovative ways to stop modern slavery. Which international organization has announced that Qatar will officially abolish its controversial exit visa system for all foreign workers by the end of 2019. Right answer is ILO. So recently, International Labour Organization has announced that Qatar will officially abolish its controversial exit visa system for foreign workers. In 2018, Qatar approved legislation to scrap Khafala system which required that the foreign workers obtain permission from their employers to leave the country. Mera India has been launched to eliminate malaria from India by which year? So right answer is 2030. Recently ICMR that is Indian Council of Medical Research has launched Mera India that is malaria elimination 
रिसर्च अलायंस टू एलिमिनेट मलेरिया फ्रॉम इंडिया बाई ट्वेंटी थर्टी हु ऑफ द फॉलोइंग हैव सिक्योर्ड ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टोक्यो ओलंपिक्स कोटा राइट आंसर इज ऑल ऑफ द बो सो रिसेंटली मिस्टर अभिषेक वर्मा सिक्योर्ड इंडिया फिफ्थ ओलंपिक कोटा प्लेस ही सिक्योर्ड कोटा आफ्टर अंजुम मुदगिल अपूर्वी चांदेला सौरभ चौधरी एंड दिव्यांग सिंह पवार सो दीज वर द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट करंट अफेयर्स ऑफ अप्रिल थैंक यू